Hi, and welcome to a three minute photo thought. So, you've finished processing your photo. It's done, and you're ready to put it out into the world. You post it on Facebook, you post it on Instagram, you post it on your website. You know what that photo means, and you know what you were trying to say with it. And it is a good photo, so everybody will understand exactly what you're trying to say because that photo speaks with clarity, right? Whoa, not so fast. Once you put that artwork out into the world, it is not yours anymore. It takes on a life of its own, and the interpretation of that image is not solely yours. Your message, your idea, your artwork, but like it or not, other people are going to interpret it. And when they ingest that artwork and interpret it, they're going to interpret it through their life experiences and through their eyes. That can lead to unintended interpretations, or at least unintended based on what you were thinking. And when it comes to that like it or not about other people interpreting your artwork, I sort of like it because it leads to an air of mystery and uncertainty. And it's really interesting to see what other people come up with when they're interpreting your artwork. Let me give you an example. This image is part of my Dreamscapes portfolio, and I'll leave a link to that portfolio in the video description. The photo is a long exposure using a zone plate with my then very young daughter and her cousin next to the ocean. Towards the end of the exposure, another cousin wandered into the frame, leaving a just visible ghostly impression. I thought the final image was about loneliness and that it contained a bit of mystery and might even be a bit spooky looking for lack of a better term. So after I had posted that image, a coworker of mine approached me and said that she wanted to buy a print of it. Now, I was sort of intrigued by this because it's an unusual sort of photo. And so I asked her what she was planning to do with it. And she said she wanted to give it to a friend as a gift and that this friend had just suffered a miscarriage. Well, I sort of was a little concerned about that. I said, isn't that going to bother the recipient? I mean, that ghost-like appearance sort of reminds one of death. And she said, no, that her interpretation was just the opposite, that even though that impression was ghost-like, it would mean to that person that even though the baby had passed, that it would still always be with her throughout her entire life and would give her reassurance and console her. Now, this was a decidedly different interpretation from mine. It's not right. It's not wrong. It's hers, not mine. Once you post that image out there, it belongs to everybody. So do you agree that once artwork is released into the world, that the interpretation of it is open to each individual? Or is it just the original artist's interpretation that's really the correct one? Do different interpretations mean that your image lacks clarity? Or is it better to have a certain amount of mystery and uncertainty so as to generate unexpected interpretations? And do you enjoy hearing other people's interpretations of your images? If you'd like to discuss that or any other aspect of people's interpretations of your artwork, please leave a comment below. I'd love to discuss it. I'm Howard, and this channel is about introducing viewers to photographers who inspire, to discussing all sorts of photographic topics, and to enhancing creativity with Photoshop and Lightroom tutorials. And if those subjects are interesting to you, I'd really appreciate your support of the channel by having you hit that subscribe button below. We'll see you next time.